Ever since I was little, I've known it's important to count the right number. Like the number of scoops I got in my ice cream cone. Hey, I asked for five. Or the number of coins in my piggy bank. I remember this one time in class. Our teacher, Mr. Noor, came in with a surprise for us. It was his birthday, so he brought cupcakes for everyone. But there was a problem. He had 15 cupcakes, and there were 20 of us in class. Mr. Noor should have counted more carefully when he was taking attendance. Counting is also really important for the U.S. Census Bureau. In the spring of 2020, it will count every person who lives in the United States. They call this count the 2020 Census. It's just like when your teacher takes attendance in class, except it's for the whole country. For the 2020 Census, the Census Bureau needs every person to tell the country they are here, in every home, in every neighborhood, in every state, on every U.S. island territory, everywhere. Tell the adults in your home to make sure they count everyone who lives with you. That includes grandparents, uncles and aunts, cousins, even people who aren't related to you who live with you. Make sure they count every kid, even babies who are one day old. Make sure they count you too, but not the cat. It's really important to count everyone. Why? Because the correct count for the 2020 census helps the government figure out what your community needs. That can be more schools, teachers, classroom computers, or after-school activities and programs. It can also mean more help for things like parks and playgrounds, housing, roads, hospitals, and so much more. The 2020 census starts in the spring, and April 1st is Census Day. Ask a grown-up in your home to circle April 1st on the calendar as a reminder to complete the census. Help us make sure we get the right count. Then we can all celebrate! Tell all of the adults in your home to make sure you're counted in the 2020 Census. Learn more at 2020census.gov.